Okay, so here we have a 1997 Gibson Les Paul Standard in Honey Burst. These are getting harder and harder to find, these 90s era Les Paul Standards, uh, especially in this good of, good of condition. Uh, it's Honey Burst, it's, it's a fantastic color on this one. It comes with the original case. As far as condition, I gave this one an 8.8 .8 out of 10. We'll call it very good. It just has some light scratches and dings, and most of the scratches <clears throat> are on the back of the guitar. Um, really, really clean. As far as some of the specs, the weight on this one is nine pounds, 10 ounces. It's got um, like a slim taper neck. I'll give you the caliper measurements though. The uh, nut width is 1.69 inches. The depth at the first fret is 0.84 inches and the depth at the 12th fret is 0.98 inches. Has a rosewood fingerboard. And then the pickups on this one, it has a 490R in the neck and a 490T in the uh, bridge position. Let's get in there and check it out. Yeah, you can see even, I mean, the top of it, it still kind of has that like new shine look to it. Really, really clean guitar. Little dings going on right there. I mean, like I said, it does have some scratches and dings, but just the sheen to it, the shine is, is uh, really nice. little teeny teeny ding right there so you can get up close on it these are just pinhead sized dings in the clear coat uh, you, head on you can't see them but this fluorescent light up there once I shine this thing in there we, we can get all the little stuff to show up rosewood fingerboard looks good on this one and the frets are perfect there is no wear uh, I've gone through and set this one up and so it plays great as well front of the headset looks really nice just some light scratches. We'll go ahead and flip this one over. Back to the headstock, there's our serial number and then our main USA. Back of the headstock looks good. There's no cracks, there's no breaks or repairs. Nowhere on this guitar, uh, looks nice and clean. Nice mahogany neck on that one. And then the back of the guitar, uh, these are the scratches that I was talking about right here. Other than that, I probably would have given this thing a 9.5, uh, but we just have some light scratches on the back of the guitar. Not a big deal. They don't uh, go into the wood or anything like that. They're pretty faint. And some little dings. Got a little ding right there, a little ding right there, but like I said, overall really consistent with the 8.8 .8 out of 10. A little bit of wear right there, you can see that. Okay, let's go ahead and flip this back over. Uh, there we have it on that one, 1997 Gibson Les Paul Standard in Honey Burst.